Visual learners, yeah, this method of doing vision as cipher is for you guys. Now, this is how tabula recta looks like. Whoa, you might think this is a lot, but don't worry. This is just all the possible, or we are here having here all the possible shifted alphabets. We have here shift key of zero, shift key of one, two, three, four, and so on. All right, so in doing tabula recta, take note that we would write, just for guidance, we would write plain text at the row part, or what I meant there is that we are to write the plain text at the upper part of our tabula recta, and keyword will be at the column part, or what I meant there is actually left part of your tabula recta, okay? So row or plain text upper keyword would be at the column right so let's apply this one um for example we are to encrypt the word hello and our keyword would be mango okay so plain text upper therefore it should look like this plain text upper and left part will have the keyword left part will have the keyword encrypt hello using the keyword mingo here in doing Vijna cipher using tabula recta you just have to get the cipher text's letter doing cross tabulation so h here first versus first h versus m h versus m cross tabulation just get the intersection of them easy should be easy so h would become what letter t because that's the intersection of letter h in our plain text and M in our keyword there so let's continue doing that one here so let's have or let's write here hello let's have that part hello and here let's have mango mango there so we're done earlier with H versus M. So our answer is letter T. So um, let's have that one here. T. So H becomes T. Next. E this time. E versus A. E here versus a at this part notice that its intersection is still letter e next l the third letter here versus the third letter here n so l here and we just have to do cross tabulation for n here so l it's l n there so that's letter y so L becomes Y. Next, L again, but this time to be paired with letter G. So L here and G at the left side. So L, G, so that would be letter R. So this would be letter R. Lastly, O. Oh, our gecko wants to discuss with us. O versus O here. Oh, there. This letter C. Uh -huh, let's have the yellow for visual learners there. So using Regina Cipher, encrypting hello with the keyword mango, hello becomes terc or T-E-Y-R-C. Now, how about this time decrypting using the same method? using the same tabula recta in the crypting guys of course what you have at hand would be 
the cipher text say t e y r c what if that's the the um cipher text that's given to you and of course the keyword would be mango so how will we retrieve back the original message here at the top tick tock tick tock what do you think is a possible way of doing it mm, let's check if what you're trying to think is the right thing here you know the t considering that it's the it's a letter in the cipher text the letters here in the cipher text are already the intersections of this letter here or these letters here versus the letters at the top. So it means that if you have here as letter M, the first letter to be paired up with T here as the first letter, from letter M, you just have to run to the right and stop at letter T. Because again, T here is already the intersection of this letter in the keyword and the upper part letter, which would be part of our plain text. Yes, easy. So that means this should be letter H. See, really for visual learners. Next, how about E versus A? So meaning from A, you run until letter E and check what's the upper part, of course. That's the same column column heading, and that's letter E. Next, Y. M here, I mean N here. So from N, you run until letter Y and check the letter at the topmost, and that is still L. Tick tock, tick tock. Try whether you guys are and G here. Let's check if your answer is correct. Three, two, one. Let's check. From G here, let's move until R there. And topmost letter is L. I hope got the you, you got the correct answer. You're a fast learner. Next, our last letter would be O here. Move until letter C. And top most letter, topmost letter there would be O. You see, we can get back the original message, which is hello. There you go, guys. So, um, practice could be try doing the word that we had in computations way. And this time, answer that using tabula recta, both encrypting and decrypting, and check if we have the same answer. We should have the same answer. Alright, see you in my next videos, guys. Thank you for being with me.